Well, Bristol Ballet is getting ready for the holidays. In fact, the organization is really getting into the giving spirit, giving parents a night out. Here with more now on some upcoming events, Amanda Hairston and Lindsay Hubbard, both with the Bristol Ballet. Great to have you ladies with us. Well, thanks Thank for having us. Just wrapped up the Nutcracker. So that's a lot of work. Yeah, we, we sold out all three shows. It was amazing. Congratulations. Thank you. That is awesome. So just when you're going to take a deep breath, you have another event coming up. <laughs> oh, for sure. It never stops, right? Right, absolutely. But this sounds like so much fun. Let's start with the parents' night out. Sure. A great opportunity for mom and dad. Oh, yeah, absolutely. So it's December 14th. 6.30 to 9.30 at the studio. Um, we will be doing a creative movement class and then we'll have a Grinch themed um, little project and then they'll watch the Grinch. Oh, how fun. Yeah. So lots of different things that night and yes. an opportunity for mom and dad to do something different. And if you were looking for something to do, you also have an event that they could take part in. They could come to the second annual Jingle Mingle. It's going to be also on December 14th. It will be from 7 to 10. It's at the Bristol Hotel. Ooh, nice. So tell me a little bit about what's in store for them with the yes. Jingle and Mingle. The theme this year is red and white. So we're asking everyone to wear their festive red and white attire. Everyone will get a welcome cocktail. We're going to have some Christmas trivia questions where they can win uh, tickets to the Paramount. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to have our Enchanted Forest silent auction. Oh, nice. And events like this are so important to organizations like the Bristol Ballet. I know this is also a fundraiser. Where does this money go and how does it help you guys as an organization? So, you know, we recently purchased our building in the summer of uh, 2021. So we have a lot of renovations going on. It helps with that. It helps with, I mean, keeping the lights on. It helps with props. It helps with so many things. It would take hours for me to cover all the things that it, that it will help Bristol Ballet. And of course, not only do you have the dance lessons, you guys in the classes, you guys also have different performances. And I would imagine, as you said, it takes a lot to put those performances together certainly does absolutely it takes it takes a, it takes a village but it also takes a lot of um, you know financial support to be able to put on the high quality level of production that we do put on and for kids that take part in dance classes we were talking about just what it teaches them in terms of yes they're learning dance but they're also learning so much more confidence mm -hmm. and team building and posture and things that, that will carry them. Absolutely. For their mm -hmm. I think one, one of the things I say is, oh, it's great if you can do a triple pirouette that, you know, that's a turn. But my job as a director is, you know, if I see a kid come in like this, but they leave like this, I've done my job. Isn't that amazing? Yeah. And you guys see that. Oh, for sure. It really carries over into the real world for our, our kids with confidence, etiquette, um, professionalism, uh, hard work. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it takes a lot of practice and hard work and those poor toes, right, <laughs> after a while. And you, you dance, still mm -hmm. dance. And you were in the Nutcracker, you were telling me. How was that? That was a lot of fun. And my husband even got to be in it with me, and he got to experience a production for the first time, and it was amazing. It is magical, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, well, we're going to give everybody the information. Obviously, the Nutcracker is over, but they are still doing their jingle and mingle, and you can find out more information by going to their website where you can get tickets. It's all happening this Thursday, beginning at 6.30. What a great night out, too, for parents to do the jingle and mingle as your kids are entertained over there as well. For more information, you can check out their website.